Hi YouTube, M6CB2E0FNM back again with another video. Today I just wanted to do a really, really quick uh, shack tour. A few people have asked me what, how I've got my gateways running, how I've set it up. Um, so it's not going to be the best sort of video. It'd be, be a bit, you know, I'll have to hold me my camera while I'm sort of showing you around. But for people that are interested, um, I said I'd do it. So you can have a quick look. It's a very basic shack. There's some really, really nice ones out there. Uh, but mine is a very, very basic shack, and it's a, just a full digital station. I don't do uh, HF anymore, uh, just just full on uh, DMR D Star Fusion. So yeah, without further ado, let's have a quick look round. So yeah, just a quick look round the shack now. Then, so as you can see, that's me, uh, me computer in there. So I do quite a bit of bit of PC gaming on there. Um, for people that are interested, obviously that's a GTX 1070 graphics card. And it's running an i7-3770 uh, computer. I built this myself. Uh, it's an old computer now, but it seems to do the, do the job for what I need. And then I've just got my uh, couple of chargers for me uh, HD1 and me Bofang. Uh, obviously my monitor. Uh, Red Rose Repeater Group, don't forget to check them out. Uh, so this is me Icom ID31 radio. Really, really nice. Uh, really like that radio. Uh, Raspberry Pi box courtesy of Wayne thank you very much Wayne for lending me another Raspberry Pi so that's uh, I kind of go I've got three of them on go at the minute uh, then I've got a, an Alent HD1 brilliant radio that's, so that's me DMR covered uh, and then this is me D star covered and then the mighty uh, FT2D which has got me uh, on fusion so those are the three handies that I use uh, and then over here we have uh, a speaker, I can't remember what it is now, uh, it's a Kenwood SP23 speaker, uh, I don't really use it at the moment now, that's just sort of put to the side. Uh, we've got the microphone that goes with the Yaesu 7800, now this is the gateway radio for MB6 IFR, so uh, let me just turn that squelch up a little bit, there we go. So yeah, that's the gateway radio for MB6 IFR. Um, it works really well for D-Star, um, no problems whatsoever, that's that's really, really works very well. Um, DMR is a bit more of a, a problem, I'm going to have to get to the bottom of that, I'm going to have to probably get a Motorola for it or something. Um, but yeah, that's the that's the 7800. Now up here we've got my uh, YSX screen, so this is what's running the uh, 2 metre gateway MB6 uh, Foxtrot Romeo. Um, and basically we have... Uh, nice home bargain struck. You gotta have your home bargain struck. Um, and then under here, so this is where it gets a bit messy. So obviously, uh, power supply uh, under there. So we've got uh, an Alinco 30 amp power supply. We have the Yesu FTM 100 as the gateway radio for MB6 FR. Uh, we have a Bose speaker there so that I can monitor uh, the gateways if I don't have my radio on. And then underneath, we get a bit more sort of messy. There's the head unit for the 7100. I'm sorry if the fans are making a lot of noise. I'm just trying to give you a good idea. Uh, and I've put fans underneath both of them to keep them cool. Obviously, they're transmitting all the time as gateways. So it's nice to have uh, a bit of bit of cooling. And I've got another fan on top of here uh, that draws some of this cool air into the power supply. And then we have a uh, YSX box. Uh, you know the HRI 200 that's there and then this is the the magic box of tricks that I made let me see if I can get in there a bit under the desk so yeah this is the uh, MMDVM repeater board on a Raspberry Pi um, and then obviously wired it into a six pin in that goes into the back of the uh, that goes into the back of the uh, get, uh, radio there and then we've got a duplexer, you can't really see it. Um, you'll have to sort of take me word for it. But I have got a duplexer down there somewhere. Um, and then I've obviously got the two meter on the on the uh, 100 and the 70 SEMs on the, uh, on the uh, 7800. So yeah, that's basically it. That's my little, uh, my little humble shack. Well, as I say, I'm uh, just mainly digital now. So I've got, uh, a gateway for D-Star, a gateway for Fusion, and once I can get a better radio, that D-Star gateway will also include uh, DMR. So yeah, that's basically it, but uh, how I get on DMR now is I have another Raspberry Pi downstairs. If you've seen my hotspot video, if not, I'll leave a link in the description where I've built a hotspot for that, uh, and that works really well. So, you know, I can get into DMR, but unfortunately no one else can yet until I can sort out the... Uh, 
um, the radio really but that's it really simple obviously then we've also got my uh, revision books for the foundation intermediate and full so that'll be uh, be going um, and that's about it really I can't think of anything else to show you but hopefully you've, you've enjoyed the little shack tour this is my little uh, uh, boom mic um, that I use sometimes for like echo link or zello as I say I've got zello on the computer as well um, so yeah, hopefully you've enjoyed it. Don't forget to join, um, take a look at Red Rose Repeater Group, also m6eb.com. Uh, I've got a good few reviews on there. So thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much. I really, really appreciate it. That was just a quick look around my uh, my shack uh, and my equipment, just so you could see it for the people that were interested. So if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. I really, really appreciate it. Don't forget to put the bell notification on so you don't miss anything. And uh, follow me on uh, Twitter and Instagram. The username is Matt underscore M6EB. I'll leave all the links in the description. And I've got my Facebook group, UK Digital Ham Radio Station. I'll leave the link in the description for that as well. So, thank you very much. I really, really appreciate it. Until the next time, I've been 2E0FNM. You've been very kind to watch. 73.